So a friend of mine asked me to look at uh, Google and he wanted an embedded Google map into his website with several markers on it. Okay, cool. So let's see Google map embedded with markers, with multiple markers. All right. Multiple markers are AP. Hmm, you cannot do this without uh, with the Google Maps eFrame embedded. Hmm, you, need, you need to go to Google Maps, Map Maker, or you need whatever. Adding. Okay, this this sounds okay. Let let's try this one. All right. Navigate yourself to this. All right, we'll do that. Link op opening in new. So let's drag this into the corner and have this text over here so we can see what we are doing. All right, so uh, did that. Sign in with your Google account. Okay, I'm signed in over here, so that's okay. Uh, Click option menu and navigate to your places maps. Create a map in the bottom. Uh, click the option menu. What is the option menu? Where is that? This is the option menu, or that's a option menu. Click on maps and create a map in the bottom. That is not what they want to. I see an option menu over here as well. Aha. Okay, so uh, again, read it. Um, go to your places. Oh, that's over here. Mijn plaatsen, plaatsen. That's Dutch. And create a map in the bottom. Okay. Oh, my home address and my work address. All right. Uh, in the bottom it says, hmm, hmm, aha, so this is the same thing I had, had before, and here it says make a card, all right, so let's say this is what, what I, I tried before, so I'm not completely sure that, that this will do oh here's an example of the of the picture so this is um, okay that's that mark where you need it okay but i want embedded code save location step three read the made my markers aha now click the share option and set the privacy to public on web Then save the details and click done. All right. Then click the option menu, title window, and hit to embed it on my website. All right. Right, 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 right. So let's go retrace this a little bit. So this was a place uh, map that I can use. So let's say I want to have. somewhere two places oh i know i want to have a marker somewhere around here yeah here oh there is a marker over here that's interesting can i use that marker add to map <laughs> okay cool i can do so if there is a, is there if, if there is already a marker i can just edit okay so, you know, let's just take another place. Let's take, um, I have to orientate myself over here. We go over here.
this place over here marker add a marker okay how do I add a marker marker over here place it here and say uh, location 2 with some text that I type in myself very interesting and say save so now I have a card with two markers and I can go on and on but I won't do that so now let's go back to what this all reads over here where did we start create blah blah, blah. we did that so we had made a map how do I save this to my stuff it's now oh it still has, has no name okay uh, example let's try it again all right done all my favorite places all right save um done so far okay we place that markers that's over here place the marker repeat step five to add multiple markers yes we did that now click the share option okay where's the share option and set it to public on the web so i need to find a share option over here and it's the dutch word dalen is share so let's do that and i have to place it public on web okay public on web i just typed that instead of a address for, from somebody is there okay done so I'm done uh, great so next then save the details and click done then save the details and click done I did that the title window I think I it says all all changes have been saved in drive okay so now I need to go back to the first address I had I guess because I have no no clue how I how I got there seems to want to be editing so let's just I did a back button of course so let's just remove this and then see ah yeah there it is places of my club this is what I wanted to do so now this is there must be something more to it oh shared Eigendom. Okay. Let's read. Embed this map. Where do I find it? Click the option menu and title. So I need probably have to have it open. I said share map. I did that already. Oh found it insluiten in my site that means actually embedded into my site so that's great now I get a bunch of code if I say yes now I have the code uh, at my hands so now I need some some page to place it in so let's do that let's just uh, phew, let me uh, prepare something uh, I've got Visual Studio over here my my favorite uh, editing program I had some testing website over here
and let's see. I had some. Oh, this is my layout page. So let's let's keep that in, in one piece. Let's just place it over here in whatever in into this diff. Ooh, I'm not sure what if this will work, but we'll see. Okay, this is not what I was copying, right? This was not the code that I wanted to copy, so that okay was not was not okay. So let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back over here. Right click, click this. Uh, oh, this one was it in in Slyton. This is the code I need actually. So I thought it would just copy it automatically uh, in into memory. Not. All right. This looks better. So let's run it. Uh, let, let's remove some old code because I was messing around with this earlier. Uh, layout. I had some scripts in here also from Google. Some other tests that I did. So let's rip those out. This script needs to be gone as well. There was also a script with multiple, multiple markers, but I couldn't get it running properly. So let's hope that this is actually easier. So let's run this. Uh, let's see in which of my screens this is opening. Ah, well, in the right screen. So there we are. Oh, well, it's a different one that I just made, but uh, it's okay. Place of my club. This is the place of my club. This is the one that I was doing. Three places. Oh, yeah. My home place and my favorite place over here. And some favorite place over here. I think this will do for anybody that needs to have a Google map in its website. Thanks for watching. Oh, feel free to subscribe if you want to follow all the rubbish that I uh, put on the, on the web.